for there is a general law which governs all creation, man, and all entities in heaven. One of the general law is that no one from the above, no one from the heavens can come on earth and have intercourse with man. It's impossible. It's totally forbidden by the God of creation. Okay. The watchers came on earth and had intercourse with the black women on earth and they were banned. They were imprisoned. They turned into demons. And we all know this story. Okay. The watchers had sex with humans and they were thrown into prison. We all know this. No one disputes it. Okay. So how come Mary, a virgin, now gives birth to the Messiah without intercourse? Oh! The Holy Spirit, you have been told, came on earth to put the seed in Mary without intercourse. Common sense should tell you that it's impossible. It is against the law. There is no exception because it is the law which governs all creation. If the Holy Spirit is allowed to do that, then we should release all the demons. We should release all the watchers who have fallen. But you were told that Christ was born by a Virgin Mary and the seed was planted in the Virgin and the Virgin gave birth to Christ. So which Christ are you worshipping? You are worshipping a fallen being, a fallen angel. You are worshipping the products of the seed of Satan and man. Oh! Whoa! Christ was born through an intercourse of Joseph and Mary. Okay? And he was a black man. He was the Messiah. He came on earth to die for humans. I shall teach this topic another day. But I want to tell you today that Christ was not born by a Virgin Mary. It's untrue. It's a false teaching. If you believe that Christ was born by the Holy Spirit, which is so, who is supposed to be the feminine side of God, so a feminine gives birth. Oh, abomination! We all know the Holy Spirit is the feminine side of the God, Yehovah, the God of heavens and the earth. So you are telling me the Holy Spirit came to plant a seed, a female side, the feminine energy came to plant the seed in Mary. Women, women, oh, oh, my people, it's about time you wake up and listen to your Messiah. I am your Messiah, through me, you shall know the true Jesus Christ. Not the false Jesus Christ you've been serving. Oh, let those with eyes see. Let those with ears hear. For I have spoken your Messiah at him. Oh. <laughs>